Hello family, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now in today's video, we are going to discuss about DXY and how I see the projection on Euro USD. Euro USD has been a nice trading setup for this past two weeks. If I was to release the video last Friday, we would have got this selling opportunity. But that's not the case. We still have more opportunities on Euro USD. But before that, we are going to discuss on on DXY and see how is USD gaining strength to give us more opportunities towards Euro USD? But to my side, I will focus on Euro USD. But on your side, you can see the other opportunities on pays paid in USD. As long as we are going to speak about DXY, for you don't know about DXY. DXY represents the strength of US dollar. Once you know the DXY market direction, technically wise. It's easy for you to trade the other pairs paired in the USC, including GBP USC, Euro USC, MCD USC, Audi USC, and much more. Now, I would ask you so you can hit that subscribe button if you have not subscribed this channel yet. But you can also like, comment, whatever you need. You can also share to other more traders who are willing to learn as you. Not this is not a financial advice that I'm going to offer here. Take into note, but you can also do your own research and advance your own trading knowledge before risking your high end money. You know what it is, you know the vibes, man. Let's jump into it. Now, this chart here you see is all about the DXY. Now, what I see on DXY is all about the bullish market momentum now i will escape this so that it can be easy for you to see what i can see here all right yes so this is dxy on daily time frame so what do we see on daily time frame on daily time frame we had the market projecting uh we had the, the bearish structure all the way from the downside these are my key points that i've highlighted right here and this one right here is the monthly level and this one the monthly level i do target this monthly levels based on key points right so they ask me to to uh, to highlight the key points along the monthly levels so that they can give me the highlight on what the market's going to do along that list uh the key level when i say the key level which means there are no more support and resistance which means these are levels where market will struggle to break through or even the testing if that level will be strong all right so for example i have this market level you see this level here this is my monthly level this is my key level but also i have this my key level right here but also i have this my monthly level this i always put this monthly levels on the monthly time frames that's why they are also named as monthly levels you can see that as long as when the price taps along this key level price it reverses you see but these other levels the i call them weekly levels sometimes they are also being respected to the lower lower time frames but let's focus on what the market has for for to offer recently you can see the market was trending on the downside but we reversed it from this key level right here which is my monthly level and we started we started the direction of the bullish market structure you can see when we created this level here which is the lower we actually got the break of structure we created a new higher area right here and we created this low by breaking the R structure with this candle strong one you can see which means we have more buyers inside this current market direction and once we got the now uh, this break of structure you can see the market collected itself by then this is uh, actual projection that i actually sent to my members or the ally members we were anticipating the bullish uh, continuation once price retraces along this key level you can say you can see the along this key level is almost between 50 percent 
and 61% of my Fibonacci reinforcement. I always use this Fibonacci just to give me the highlighation of what is going to happen up next, all right? Now, you can see recently, this is on the Delta frame, guys. On, on my Delta frame, price has got a break of structure right here, directing itself toward this strong high. Now, I call this a strong high, dialect wise because this is the only high that caused this volume in the market you can see this is strong candle right here once we got this break you can see market went all the way down so this level here is going to be respected more times until market decides to break it or to lead us as price action will be uh will be portraying in the future right so this is uh, actual candle formation that we have on the daily which is not yet closed but once we zoom it down you can see we have a breakout this candle here is literally a break break of structure as long as so long as right now the market is almost ending to break that level now i can call it a break of structure because that that kind of formation is recently going to close so once once to closes above here this is called the breakout structure because we have this impulse and this correction we have the other impulse so we'll be expecting before price tapping these highs here to have another correction like this one right so to the matter of dxy once dxy is uh is in a bullish momentum like this basically to the side of US dollar, which means it's gaining strength. Now, you'll see particularly other pairs pairing US dollar on the on the on the currents paired with the US dollar, US dollar is gaining strength. Now you'll see pairs like um, maybe NZD US dollar, you'll see it selling because USD is gaining strength, but the NZD is losing strength you get a concept but when you see it to the side of maybe euro usd you'll see euro usd get, uh, i mean the euro is losing strength but us dollar is gaining strength basically because we have the quote currents and the best currents you see that chart going downside we've been a bearish structure right so now i'll be projecting the dx uh dxy to tap these levels here. this is my next day high which is ritually along these attempts we have the sellers attempt here we have the other sellers attempt here which is the strong strong high you can see this is my strong high but again it's almost between the negative 61 of my fibonacci reinforcement level and the negative 27 of my adjustment level. Basically, I will be looking forward to see how price will be reacting toward this level. As long as you have this impossible move, if this DXY one day candle closes like this, we'll be the we'll be having the other candle kind of formation, maybe uh bouncing this level or even retracing itself towards maybe like this and tapping this level before coming back this level this is what i see now bear in mind this is only what i see right now price do changes with time so you have to watch it yourself and see how price will be reacting now let's see on euro usd now this is the euro usd now is watching right now let's see start from the weekly weekly basis now on the weekly basis you'll see price like this one you'll see like uh in the meantime recent tree based on the current structure the price is in this format this is a current structure but if you view it in a in future wise or in long term wise you'll see that we are having a bullish structure so basically this is the it's like a how do you call it the side way way maybe but inside this you can also trade that's why we are going to focus on the current wise see how price is uh, is is doing but the the thing is you have to
put this in your mind like uh, to watch the price projection in the long term to see what other people are doing all the other uh, guys that are always maybe uh position traders what are position traders you doing now this is uh on the daily time frame now what do you see on daily time frame based on my experiences on uh euro usd currently now is watching like uh, we are having a push toward the downside because we have this projection or the sellers attempts where we got this buyers attempts where we got this breakout structure so listen to because we have rejected this point which is my key level on the weekly basis the weekly basis time on the on the weekly now what i see right now is to find out like price has to come to lead us along these levels and along these levels but the high probability one is these levels because it's a 50 percent of this total bullish structure now what i'll be watching recently because this weekly candle line now is closing but as you can see the last two weeks price was creating this nice structure once you see price creating these highs these lows these highs the breaks and these lows these highs this is a nice structure for you to trade it you can simply analyze it and take selling opportunity once you see that because that's how price moves okay price moves in in a way of like this for example if it's in a downtrend you see price making these highs and lows highs and lows highs and lows so for you to find opportunities you have to look at how price will be reacting towards these levels before price changing the direction for example once it breaks and then to collect itself along these key points along these highs you'll see that the uh, price has created the nice uh, candle formation like maybe in graphing or doge candle whatever you have to find out before entering a trade so what do i see on eu uh this is a current move right now this is a current move but the targeted level is this level here but as long as not only when price goes to dilation like this it will create another correction like this for example you see this is a daily candle you see this is what price did then collected itself like uh, five days you see it's almost a week here because i think uh, the liquidation was a little bit low i think it was uh, about three weeks back and then price did like this you see and again we can how i can project that uh, before tapping these levels depends on what volatility it will be showing up in the market i have to see price elite testing again in these areas right here so that we can tap this down push this is what i see on either usd based on one day time frame now you have to watch yourself how you'll be trading the euro usd based on how you trade it but this is how i project it based on one day but let me zoom it out on the on four hours time frame on the four hour time frame same applies here's where we got a breakout structure now let me move those zones because sometimes you may see like ah, is that a demand supply a demand level or whatever this is our breakout structure here this is a breakout structure that you always see so listen to what you can expect depends on how this candle will close on the four hours time frame so what you can watch it out is you have to see how you'll see price if once it creates a candle maybe the uh, the liver so on then you can project to see how price will be will be will collect itself towards any point of your interest depends on how candle formation will be formed right here which is the price action candle formation can see which candle formation this this almost the tweezer tweezer top all right this uh what candle kind of formation this let me show love because this is my, this might be half maybe to your side but when i say the live vessel candles i mean this one before price pushing in the direction of your interest so it's what I see on yellow USD, but based on what I see on the other side, which is the fundamental part, 
let's see the fundamental point maybe once we have the fundamental reports based on our new euro maybe we can have a strong volatility let me remove all these stars and then apply now i'm always watching the the high impact one uh this week we have mm, we have the ust unemployment claim yeah but you also have the P pmy fundamental reports on the us dollar and again this one will be on wednesday january 24 which is tomorrow by then and uh, the next one will be on thursday which will be on unemployment claim and on friday which will be the call price index so these are high impact one based on the ust this is according to this week all right so you can watch it out and see how you can project it but not only USD, you can also watch other pairs bearing USD. for example gbp usd we have audi dollar and much more thank you for watching this youtube video along to the end make sure you hit that subscribe button if you have not followed this channel yet but I also have the other channel of FXB University. This is a WhatsApp channel. This is where I'll be sharing the projections, not in a video for my boy. I'll be sharing what I see on these pages. Make sure you follow. The link is in the description. Thank you. See you to the next video. Shalom. Take care.